hello everyone welcome back to my channel in this video i'm going to continue my tutorial series about how to create multiplayer game using photon and unity in this video i'm going to attach my camera here to the game object so we can control the we can control the player and the camera is following the player object this uh, camera system should be very simple it's not following object but the camera will be the child of the player object this is my player object I'm going to add a camera 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 3d object camera here okay this is our camera um yeah this way and i will remove the camera from this from the scene and i'm going to need a plane so we can see how we navigate around in our scene plane and this plane um, I will add a texture to it do I have a texture let's grab some Grid texture This one Okay, maybe this one Grid I will bring it here I'm going to create a material and apply it here. Set the tiling to 100. Yeah, 100. What? This one. Okay. Let me play the game and instantiate. Right now, there is no camera, no problem, uh, because the camera is inside the player object. We did not instantiate the player right now. I'm going to enter my nickname and connect and play. Here is our player. The player and the camera is attached. I can navigate around. You can rotate by pressing Q and E button. This way. Okay and I will export this project as an executable file for Windows and I'm going to run it and I will show you the most common problem when you start with multiplayer game development you will find some uh, confusing camera issue I will show you how to fix it later let me run this one and the second one player one cube connect and play player two sphere connect and play you see here at the beginning 
uh, if I remember I was player one here but when I enter and connect I see that I am player two let me start over because I was not so sure okay, this one is for player one player one cube connect and play right now I'm player one here <coughs> at the left screen and if I enter with player to enter the game as a sphere and connect and play you will get some strange issue now here you became become player one if you move your keyboard uh, your character using keyboard you see that one is moving but this one not moving this is common camera issue guys and I will let you know how to solve it let's close them to solve that problem we go here inside this camera this camera object should be deactivated if this camera is not ours is if this camera is not my camera I should deactivate it because if this camera is the second player's camera I should not look at the game from that camera I should look at the game from my own camera that is the point so I'm going to create a script I call it deactivate if not mine <laughs> okay double click and as usual we are going to use this using photon.pan and monopiaver callback pan callbacks and here we check if photon view dot is mine let me check capital i if it is not mine I should deactivate this camera so let's set uh, get component camera set set active false let's try this one set active get component camera or let's just call set active files with the s what is the problem game object dot set active files a second guys okay this is the correct one let's try to attach that script to this camera it will deactivate this object or any object with this script if it is not ours so I will export the game once more once more and let's see <coughs> if we can solve it Right, it is here. I'm going to run the first instance and this one for the second one. Player one cube connect and play. Now I am a player one with cube avatar. Let's let the player to enter as a sphere, connect and play. You see that guys we solve the camera problem I can still control the game using this 
looking around using my own camera not using the second player camera okay and one more thing maybe I will show you also here if you see this player name it is not looking at the camera we need to make the player UI player text the name text to always looking at the camera so it is easy but I forgot the code let me check uh, unity get active camera camera find object on the camera okay I copy this line guys you can find out this forum like I did and go back here go to show player nickname script this script is that one that shows us the nickname of the player I paste it here oops Closed it accidentally. All right. If camera, I don't know. Let me try this one. Transform. Uh, look at camera. Game object transform. Let me go back to Unity to check is there any compilation error. Okay, seems everything okay. And let's build the game again. I'm going to run the game first player second player P1 cube connect and play P1 okay it is facing the opposite direction of the camera we will fix that we will fix it later I will show you now we are player 2 but it is inverted but no matter how we rotate the camera the text always fake facing our camera on both players the only problem is the orientation of the camera the text okay let's fix it by going to these resources and player text uh, how should I flip it <coughs> maybe the scale the Y scale we can <coughs> invert it this way or no yeah we can invert the Y scale not Y scale the Z scale Y scale this one which one is X the X scale yeah we set the X scale to negative 
it will be a quick trick to solve that problem and I will publish the game again it will be very quick and here we go player 1 cube connect player 2 sphere connect you see that the text is correct it is always facing towards the each player's camera player 1 player 2 player 1 and player 2 all right guys that's all for this video see you soon on my next video in case you are new uh, just watching this video and did not watch my previous video please check out my previous video so you won't get confused because it is part of my tutorial series about how to make unity multiplayer game the link of the playlist is in the description of the video bye bye guys see you soon